Imagine yourself sleeping in your warm bed in the early morning, hearing a whispering voice telling you, do you want to have a miserable, terrible, and horrible day? Or do you want to have a memorable, enjoyable, and remarkable day? You open your eyes to see who it is. Nobody is there. Do you believe that you have a choice? Mr. Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, after listening to my speech, you will get, after listening to my speech, you will get, after listening to my speech, you will get the ideal, you will get, you will learn how to have an enjoyable day. Have you ever felt the breast in your life? Do you remember how painful it was? Yes. I still remember clearly what happened to me on June 6, 2006. It was shortly after the stock market crash. <laughs> I was sitting in my friend, in my brother Hussein house, in the dining room, when he said to me, you keep nagging your fathers like a wife. <coughs> fathers, take a bank loan and let me invest it for you in the stock market. Father, you will pay all your debts within three months. Father, the Saudi stock market is booming down. Tell me now, the money drained from the stock market like a water <coughs> through the sink. Can you tell me how your father will pay that affordable 9,000 Saudi riyals per month for the upcoming 10 years? And be able to meet the endless need of your brothers. At this moment, I want to, to put my head in the sand like an ostrich, but I couldn't. I want to escape from that tragedy, but I couldn't. I wake up with it. I slept with it. I act with it. I drink with it. I walk with it. I stop with it. People get sick and tired from hearing me complaining about my tragedy day after day, week after week, month after month. And for 18 months, rather than getting better, my stress grew bigger. Inflating like a barrel, I felt as if I would explode. People tried avoiding me, not answering me, walking away from me. Ladies and gentlemen, I knew that I had to find a solution for my tragedy, or I would lose my sanity. I enter my Mr. Friend Al Habbas office, complaining again about my tragedy. But Ali that day said something different to me. He said, You can choose to be a victim of your tragedy, or you can choose to learn from it. I look at him in a sarcastic way. He said, Muhammad, every morning when you wake up, please remember that. You can choose to have a miserable day, or you can choose to have a memorable day. You can choose to look at what you have lost, or you can choose to look at what you have left. And I left him. But his word is stuck in my mind, playing over and over again, like a broken record. You can choose, you can choose, you can choose. And I started asking myself why I did not learn from my tragedy. Why? And do you know why I did not learn from my, from my tragedy? No. Mm -hmm. Do you think I can learn from my family member? Or from my work colleague? Or from my friend? No way. They were more frustrated than I was. We complain about our tragedy more than our uncle complaining about their appraisal. Ladies and gentlemen, study show. Hearing someone speaking negatively is bad for our health. And if you hear the same negative comment too often, <coughs> too often will turn to a reality. So imagine how much more hearing our negative self talk can be. <coughs> our brain exactly like. A car, paper, a, a, car, 
akarbon beba. Whatever we see, whatever we hear, whatever we say, it will print it on our brain. And it will, and it will reflect on our action. For example, if you choose to say, I cannot do this, guess what? You cannot do it. Because your stress, because your negative thought increases your stress and stop your brain from finding a solution for, for your question. But if you choose to say, how can I do that? Does not sound more hopeful and give your brain the power to search for a solution? Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, our life is based on our choice. I still paying that affordable bank loan, but I have a positive friend. They call themselves a Toastmaster. And every day before I jump out of my bed, my inner voice whisper in my ear, Muhammad, you will have a memorable, enjoyable, a remarkable day because you choose to be a happy person.